everyone and welcome back to the channel as always i'm thrilled to have you here in my echoey man cave that um, only a couple of people ever complain about so let's not worry about that anywho um today i got a couple of giveaways because it's that time of the week again um well and the winner from last week uh which was uh arbori biashi uh, never came forward to uh, claim his prize, so I take it he must have not watched last week's video. Um, so, uh, the way the rules go, if you don't contact me within a week, it uh, gets redrawn. So, we're going to have a redrawing of this giveaway today, which is the blue tray and three um, lock holders. Um, this week's giveaway is the golden tray with three more lock holders um so we'll be drawing that one today too and i'll be announcing uh, next week's giveaway <laughs> which is a, another one of the golden trays this is a uh, slightly smaller and there's going to be something special added to that one by the end of the video here but i don't want to get into that right now yes i do okay so I am going to throw in a pick. That's the handle 3D printed. I just haven't glued the tip in yet. Um, that won't take me long to get ready for you. And then we're going to include this. Um, well, it's an Abus lock. No, it's not. It's a Trekmaster 30. No, it's not. It's a Foxy designed lock. Um, Foxy 3 guys. Um, he's, he designed this uh, lock and the mechanism and everything, and I just went in and remeshed the Abus logo onto the side of it uh, when I made it. Uh, but right now it's uh, zero bitted, and it does work. And uh, you see the key is zero bitted right now. Uh, I will have the key cut uh, to bidding, and I might even put some uh, spools in it uh, before it gets sent out. Uh, this is kind of a neat thing. Uh, it's just a. <laughs> it's really fun. 3D printed locks. Who would have thought? Now I'm working on the design of my own right now of an American lock, but uh, <laughs> this is uh, really cool. So, since this was really cool, and Foxy, thank you for designing it and sending me the plans to it. Um, I finally got around to getting it all printed and working and tested out. So,. Uh, Thank you very much, sir. Um, but that's just really cool. Anywho, that's going to go into next week's giveaway. And, uh, well, since I was talking about this 3D printed Abus that I kind of came up with, I think I'm going to pick an Abus. Uh, about the same size, roughly. Let's see here. Uh, a little bit bigger, but an ADTI 40. Um... Yeah, just a little taller, about the same width. And I've picked uh, one of these on camera before, and uh, they're kind of fun picks. Um, Abus has their standard uh, way of uh, making security pins that just give you varying degrees of feedback. And these TIs, in my opinion, are very, very good locks to pick. There we go, got zoomed in for you. So to pick this one, I'm going to use a top of the keyway tensioner, which I just slid all these out of the way, didn't I? I want to use that one. That's about a uh, 25 thousandths tensioner. And I'm going to use this pick here. It's kind of a uh, short hook with a little bit of a swoop to it. I'm going to start in the front and work my way back. Okay, there's a click from one, nothing on two, three is bound, okay, there's three, come back up and test two and one, nothing, okay, go to four, four is bound, okay, go on to five, got a click from five, let's come back up to the front, nothing. Pin three. 
tape pin six feels bound. Okay, there's six. Okay, come back to the front. Nothing on one. Nothing on two. Nothing on three. Four is bound. Five, nothing. And nothing on six. So nothing on one. There's a little bit off of two. There's a little bit off of three again. Two is back down. There we go. One is back down. Okay, pin six. Lots of back and forth dropping the pins over and over again, but uh, these titaniums are known to cause that. Dropped a bunch of pins. Okay, six. Okay. I didn't like how that one went into place, but I still got a slight false set. That was two. That was three. That was four. That was three. All right, six is down. There we go. Just a little bit of ping pong back and forth. You gotta love the spool ping pong that game that Amos makes you play. It just makes a really fun pick. Um, so there we go. But uh, Abus ADTI 40. I've got a several of these ADTIs, and uh, they're all fun, guys. Give them a chance. All right, so it's time for the redraws. Uh, no gutting today since that was an unguttable padlock. Um, so let me get the camera moved over to the computer, and uh, well. Just slide some stuff out of the way and get moved over here. So, this is the video URL I've got in place from last week. I really need to do a better job of cleaning up around here. Um, but anyway, um, 22 unique commenters, and we'll go ahead and start the drawing again. And the winner is Size Pays or Size Pays, Size Pays. All right, man. You are the redrawer of last week's giveaway, which is the blue tray with the red lock holders. Congratulations, man. You've got one week to contact me, or it's going to be drawn off again to somebody else. Um, my preferred method of contact is a private message on YouTube. Go to the About tab on my page and send me a private me or on my channel and send me a private message. Yes, YouTube's going to be taking that feature away before too long, and uh, we'll have to figure something else out. But right now, that's still the way to do it. All right, so let's go ahead and pull in the URL for this week's giveaway. This time I only had 16 unique commenters, so uh, really good chance to get a prize. And we're going to go ahead and click Start. 
And the winner of this week's giveaway is Iggy Mac. Um, Iggy Mac, thank you for commenting. And thank you for being a subscriber, man. I've seen you comment on a lot of my videos. So uh, you've won the, uh, the gold tray with the black lock holders. And, uh, well, next week's giveaway, guys, is going to be on the 3D printed padlock, a lock pick, and the, another one of the golden trays. So uh, it's going to be a great giveaway for next week. So always remember, contact me through instant message on, or not instant message, through a private message on YouTube, and uh, we'll get uh, your address that way. So folks, please stay safe. Don't do anything illegal. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, if you see a lock out there in the wild, and you don't have the key for it, just don't stick a pick in it.